Y'all act like God don't see you and see everything you do. But God judge everything you do. And the Most High God see everything you do. He hears everything you say, everything you think. He knows it. Everything you gonna do, he knows it, man. This is Ecclesiasticus, chapter 23, verse 19. Such a man only fear of the eyes of men and knoweth not that the eyes of the Lord are 10,000 times brighter than the sun, beholding all the ways of men, considering the most secret parts. Okay, so even in secret, the Most High God is still judging your thoughts, man. That's why we got to guard our heart, man. We got to guard our heart. Hey, how you doing, brother? Right. What's your father's nationality? You know you're a Hebrew Israelite? No. Hey, come here this real quick, real quick. Two seconds. All right, bet. You gonna come back? All right, bet that up. All right, bet that up. See, this brother's sincere. You know, he at least got a minute for the Most High God. Hey, God bless you, brother. Okay, brother, brother Ephraimite. Okay, from the tribe of Ephraim. All right. So, Lord willing, the Lord has mercy on that man because he was willing enough to hear the word of the Most High God. But all you other people who are out here still playing with the Lord, he gonna destroy y'all, man. Okay? Let's get that real quick, because nobody wanna listen to the counsel of the Lord, right? Psalms chapter one, starting at verse 22. How long ye simple ones, will ye love simplicity? And the scorners delight in their scorning, and fools hate knowledge. What is knowledge? Psalms 1, 111 verse 10. The commandments, man. That's wisdom and knowledge. Turn you at my reproof. And behold, I'll pour out my spirit unto you. I will make word my no my the white man going into slavery. I will make my words known unto you. And because I have called and ye have refused. And I have stretched out my hand, and you no know man regarded, but ye have said I not by reproof, and counsel with none of my reproof. I will laugh at your calamity, and I will mock when your fear coming. That's what the Most High God says to you when you don't want to listen to his word. He's going to laugh at your destruction. He's going to mock at your calamity when you're crying for him. When your fear cometh as a desolation and your destruction cometh as a whirlwind when distress and anguish cometh upon you that shall call upon me but I will not answer and they shall seek me early but they shall not find me so the most high God said you don't listen to him right now before the day of judgment comes you're going to call upon him and he's not going to listen to you he's going to turn his face from you the most high God going to go like this he ain't going to hear you man you out here still playing with him. All right? Death to America and death to you two third ass niggas. You wicked ass niggas, man. Death to y'all. All right? Hopefully the brother come back in time. But I want to say, man, I can't stress this enough. We got to come back to the Lord with all sincerity of heart. Okay? Because the Most High God, he's not playing games, man. We, yeah, people, so, so Esau, he the number one sellout, right? Right, Esau the number one sellout. Let's get that real quick because the so-called white man was most likely the first nigga to sell his soul to the devil. All right? But we sold our soul to God. Okay, we sold our soul to righteousness. But when we forsook that covenant, that's why our people out here still being oppressed by the so-called white man. And we at the bottom of the food chain, so to speak. But we was at the top at one point. We were gods on this earth, according to the Bible. Okay? So the, the so-called white man, Esau, is the, is the original sellout. This is Genesis chapter 25. This is Genesis chapter 25. Starting at 
verse 29, and Jacob, our forefather, saw a pottage, and Esau came from the field, and he was faint. And Esau said to Jacob, you got a minute, brother? No, bro, not really, dog. Be honest with you, All right, let me tell you, you something real quick. Get a phone, you got a number. Get a phone. Hey, huh? You got a number, you say? Yeah. Call you? 6820. Write it down for me real quick. I can't got no pen. I got you. Hold up, y'all. The white man, the original sellout, but hold up, this brother's sincere, so we're gonna uh we're gonna get at it real quick. <laughs> 